Hello, it's Nick, and today I want to show you how to create an animated skeleton screen in Figma. A skeleton screen is used as a placeholder while users wait for a regular screen to load. And usually users have to wait for a few seconds before that happens. But this screen provides benefit. It allows users to see the page layout. And to create a skeleton screen, I will use a mobile screen of the food ordering app and the plugin called Ghost. I will leave the link to the plugin in the description and I will need to copy the screen I've created before and activate the plugin. So the plugin will create the skeleton screen out of the design. So I will need to choose the color for the elements. I will choose gray and I will use the solid color. So this is it. This is a placeholder screen created from the one that we provided. And as you can see, it has some issues, like as elements are not perfectly aligned and we can change it. And I don't want to spend a lot of time al aligning the elements, uh, just change it a little bit to make it slightly a bit more visually appealing. What I will need to do next, I want to create a flow. To create a pulsing effect, I will need a copy of the screen with a slightly different styling. I will change the color of the elements to make it more saturated. So I will use the color like that. And we're basically ready to create the flow. So what we will do next, I will use the copy of these screens. So I will need at least two screens for each state. And the final one will be the home screen. So let's put it here. I will give the name on the number for each screen. So it will be five screens. And then I will need to go to the prototype mode to create the transition. So uh, what we will need to do, we need to connect the screens and I will just simply create a connection between screens and it will be after delay, it will be one mile, milliseconds delay and the effect will be smart animate and the actual effect will be in, easy in, in and out back with the 450 milliseconds. We will use the same effect for all other screens in our flow, so we will, it will be the same after delay and the effect will be the same smart animate. Uh, after delay, one milliseconds and the last one. Okay, now we need to select the first frame and choose the preview mode. Let's see what we will get. All right, this looks wonderful, I think. So this is it. This is how you can create a skeleton screen in Figma in no time. Thank you.